Sailability is all about getting people on the water. It's a, allowing people to experience the freedom and getting out there and just enjoying it. It's all about family and friends um, and being part of the community again. The boats were designed to make it easy to get into sailing. So they were designed using the principles of, uh, of universal design so that it, uh, everybody can use them whether they're left-handed, right-handed. So we have people of all, all abilities who are all sailing together. They're safe, they're comfortable and they're really simple and easy to sail. Oh, just get out there. It's the most beautiful thing in the whole world and everything else is gone. When you're out there on the water, everything else is out of your mind and it's just you and nature and enjoyment. These boats, you don't, they don't capsize, so if you want to get out and you want to get going on your own and learn to sail a boat without that fear of capsizing like some of the other off the beach classes, it's a fantastic boat to get into and they're simple, they don't have all the different ropes so it's less confusing from the start. It's just like being part of a big family really, you come to regattas and you see people you haven't seen for 12 months and it's just like you haven't been apart. <laughs> One of the things when you get out on the water it's impossible to tell whether a person has a disability or is an able-bodied person. It's just all about sailing. You become a sailor once you're out on the water. The disability component disappears. For a disabled person to be in a boat with themselves making the decisions what they do and where they go is really a... it's unique for them. It gives you a great feeling of freedom. And so for those short time, an hour or two or three, they're in charge of their own destiny. And so for those people that are less athletic and less able, and they think, oh, they could never do sailing, they can. Sailability is not just about the sailing component. There's a lot of behind the scene things that need to be done. And that's not just for able-bodied people to do. Any, any disability can be involved in sailability. And we have many people with disabilities helping on the administration side of things as well. We have quite a few that have gone through and got their safety boat operator's license people with kind of jumping into boats and operating a safety boat that probably 10 years ago wouldn't have been thought possible but now now happens on a regular basis. I've done two worlds, one in the UK for world access class and one for Special Olympics. Part of doing Special Olympics side of things to give back to what I've learned in the past. The sailing community since I've been involved has been ever so embracing, so really open their arms up, open their hearts up to make it possible and include us. I mean, we are part of the sailing community now. To be on the AST besides Slingsby and the guys is just really empowering. People with disabilities, it's ac having access to sailing is just having access to the world. It's so free to be out there on the water and if people just open their doors to people with disabilities and the support will come and it's just possible. Like, just making it possible, just do it. Try it, you'll never look back. I didn't.